to drop Jason Silverthorne facing off with Joel Champagne a big game awaits between these two clubs and we're on the way the left side bounds quickly padding away good opportunity to start with this Silverthorne and a great head on the ascendancy Champagne bounds with a block no, no trims in there from the whole goalie 5.15 into this first period Silver form plays in Doucette Doucette looking for the opening goes just wide of Kyle Jones goal Bull head bringing it out defending well Listen to the reverse pass to Doucette, Doucette with a chance, deflected off Kyle Jones, gets it away. All continuing the pressure, allows him with a shot, Jones gloving it well in midair. Pass in, that was a punt with his new trim. It's a break now from Brayhead Clan, Haywood, two on one, he's got Cullen alongside him. It's a goal for John Boyd! Brayhead Clan go into the lead! Breakaway from Greyhead Clan. Matt Hayward spying Joe Cullen coming in on his right hand side. Cullen sweeping it past Ben Bounds. Greyhead got one goal to nil up. Hayward. Oh. There's Edmund Green there with a chance, but it's a breakaway for Hull. Do say a wonderful save from Kyle Jones. Do say found himself playing on the clan goal. Well played by Kyle Jones, keeping his eye on the puck at all times and managing to block the effort. Do say they are looking for what would have been his eighth goal of the season. The head goalie was in equal form. Played in this first period, Brayhead Clan goal up on Hull Stingrays. Trim. Back to Chris Frank inside the whole zone. Plays it into the middle. Tendler picks up the loose puck. Hull turning that round again. Pasha into the middle there for Matt Davis. And Tendler couldn't quite make contact with it. Oh, I think that was Shane Lust there. Cullen is Lust. Oh. Away by Brown's pads. Do set this trim. Trim sweeps a shot wide. This flank. There's no trim. 30 seconds left of the first period. Can Brayhead open up a two goal gap before the first period, before the end of the first period? Oh, and hold on the breakaway now. Carl Lausen. Lausen. He's put it through Jones' legs. It's a goal for Hull Stingrays with 11 seconds left of the first period. A well taken goal from Stingrays' man. And the Stingrays equalise. Hull have a power play now on 27 20 of this match. A chance for them to go ahead. 
a chance, an opening that will beat Kyle Jones. That's a shot there, well caught by Kyle Jones. Oh no, Pasha. Three against three in the Brayhead zone. Here's Tendler. Oh, and Tendler scores! Sweeps the puck into the net. Five seconds left before the power play. Tendler finding the net against Brayhead, getting that 30 second point in the fixtures against Brayhead clan. Tendler very much the danger man for Hull Stingers tonight. Oh, it's a goal for Hull. Sylvain Klutek scores on a rebound. 41-13 into this match. Klutek, the player coach. Then that's two in a row. Back in now. Plan win the face off. So he couldn't quite control it. Tendler. Down that left hand side, plays it back the way. Pass in there to cover, helps out Jones. He gathers with his glove. That opens that gap up between the two teams again. Haywood with a chance here. Bounds, gets a save, falls out for the rebound. And Brayhead have scored! 7.40 left to play. Just pulled. We had going six on five in terms of skaters, keeping the pressure on. Face off down the other end now. Jones back in goal. Take it now, Ed McGrain. Jones pulled again. Brayhead applying the extra skater here. Looking for that extra man that'll give them the advantage. Hull sweep the puck away. Scott Arsene picks it up. Jumping much in there, Hull. Oh! That was Tendler in there. Almost getting that puck into the net, it goes wide, Brayhead forward again, Trim. Shot from Champagne, saved by Bounds, goes back out again. This is last throw of the dice, stuff from Brayhead now. They get the puck forward. Touched on from Haywood. And that's it. It's all over. Tendler puts the puck down the ice. It's enough for Hull to hold off for a big away win, another away win in Scotland, their third of the season. Already betters, they're two from last year in 16 games. Brayhead clan managed to pull one back in the third period. Matt Haywood's unassisted goal on 52-20. They couldn't quite get the win though, at the very least the equaliser. That club record of eight wins in the Elite League on the trot is safe for now. Brayhead Clan lose tonight by three goals to two to Hull Stingrays.